What's up, guys? Welcome to my crib. Let me show you guys around. This is my living room here. This is where uh, a lot of my uh, Monobi events uh, take place. I do a tastings probably every Thursday and Sunday night at my home, opportunity meetings. It's where it gives a chance for everyone to hang out. I like the op open setting in the house. It's a single story home. And uh, as you can see, I got the 50 inch plasma up to play the Monobi Momentum video. Let me show you some more of the house. This is my office it's where I come check out the Monobi, uh, my Monobi tree, uh, find out uh, what's going on in the business as far as where my points are going and where I'm at for the week and uh, just making sure everyone's on their A game. Now, let me take you guys through the, the rest of the house. In here is my kitchen. This is probably my favorite thing in the whole entire house because you know I don't have to wonder what's in the fridge. You can see right through it, obviously. And uh, don't let me fool you, but my fridge doesn't look like this all the time. Right here, we got the Monavi Pulse. Obviously, this is gonna help blow up our business now. Uh, right next to the Monavi, we got the egg beaters. I chug this down. Me and Kelly chug one of these downs before we work out in the morning every single day. Actually, that's pretty disgusting, but. All right, so now it's time for me to show you guys the rides. This is my brand new uh, S550 Mercedes. Compliments of Monavi for hitting that milestone rank of Black Diamond Executive. It's all rimmed up, ready to go. Another uh, car I have right here is uh, my brand new BMW 750 Li. It's another toy of mine. I got it uh, badged up in the back with Monavi, so everybody knows, you know, what's providing the uh, the income for me to to afford these these nice things. All right, so this is usually how my day starts. Actually, at about 6 a.m. in the morning, I get a call from Kelly, or I get a text from Kelly Bangert, which is my next door neighbor, Royal Black Diamond Executive, who sponsored me into this business. Or he has his little daughter, his little, his little two-year-old daughter, Ava, call me and say, money doesn't sleep, Calvin, get to work. Then uh, Kelly usually meets me at my house, or we both meet up at the gym in the morning, and that's usually where uh, Kelly's giving me all my constructive criticism I need for the day or for the week, you know, telling me, you know, get your business moving, keep sponsoring people. You know, you're not moving fast enough, and it really gets me out there, you know, sharing the opportunity and sharing the credibility of, of the company, and it really gets me out there driving and hustling every day to build this business further than I've even taken it already. Monavi is a synergistic blend of 19 fruits that come from all around the world. There's glucosamine that helps with your bones and joints. I can go on and on about this product. Cut, 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 cut. Man, I leave for five minutes, and you're trying to steal my fame right now? What, well, are you the Black Diamond? Can I be in the spotlight just one day out of your life? <laughs> Hey, well, you know, network marketing pretty much requires you to duplicate yourself, and uh, that's pretty much what I did when I hit the rank of Black Diamond. I invested in my own clone, right? That's true. Actually, this is this is my this is my twin brother, uh, Brandon, and uh, you know, uh, he pretty much gave me uh, a lot of the competition while growing up in my life in order for me to work harder at everything I did. And uh, we grew up with a single mom. We had a sister who was about four years younger, and it was really tough for us to even survive where we lived. Um, you had to put food on the table, clothes on our back, and my mom was really struggling a lot. And uh, me and my brother took it upon ourselves at an early age to, um, to go out there and start working when we were about eight and a half years old. And we started mowing lawns and washing cars for everybody. We, can, we knocked on every single door. And uh, we did that probably up until we were about 14, 15 years old. And uh, we'd collect money on the weekends. And when we collect that money every weekend, we'd take it right back home where we'd give it to our mom to help her pay the utilities. And uh, I remember my mom would always say, you know, the only way we're gonna get out of here and get out of this environment is for you and your brother to go to college one day. In order to get scholarships, Taney, Taney, really good university, we had to go to a high school with a good academic program and good athletic program. And we ended up finding a high school in Concord, California by the name of De La Salle High School. And uh, we ended up taking the test and getting accepted into there. And my mom said, you know what, I can't afford that high school. And uh, we said, don't worry about it, we're gonna figure it out. And uh, do you remember that and summer? I think, I think we, uh, for about a month straight, we. Went after application after application, job after job, interview after job interview. We got our work permits, we were around 15 years old. So we just, we, we ended up getting hired by a couple places. And so what we did was in the morning, we'd take the bus to school, probably about five, arrive there about five in the morning, walk to our job, we were janitors in the morning. We'd go to school, go to the library, do our homework, just get done with all our studies. We'd carry on the day through school, and then we'd go to our, onto our sports activities. And then after that, uh, we'd run all the way to Exxon gas station where we were the shop boys, basically plugging flat tires, changing oil, cleaning up the, up the shop after the mechanics left. From there, we'd run across that same parking lot to Applebee's where we were host and servers. We'd collect our checks every couple weeks and take them right to the tuition department at school and uh, sign them over to De La Salle. We paid our tuition uh, during our term of high school. 
and then we ended up getting scholarships um, to college, you know, top, top university for, for athletics and academics. And, you know, we went off to get our bachelor's degree and uh, I went off and got involved in real estate and mortgage where I succeeded in. Brandon went off and got his master's degree and started a, a couple of his own successful companies in the area. And, uh, you know, we ended up, you know, moving my mom back down here uh, and buying her a home in Southern California. Uh, from here, I could take it from here though, man. Th thanks for stopping by though. Oh yeah, no, I appreciate no problem, it. man. Glad I can help. Right, Love you. Easy. Love you too, man. <laughs> All right, so uh, every once in a while, I'll get a few of my key leaders that are really um, positioning themselves well in this business by duplicating what I'm doing, showing up to the events. We'll get together and we'll strategize. You know, we'll tell each other, you know, what's been working for us this week, or we just give people motivation and inspiration to keep driving this business along. Calvin's, uh, his story is actually truly amazing. He has inspired everybody. I mean, from what he came from to where he is today and what he's accomplished with Monavi in such a short time is unbelievable. So he's inspired everyone. He gives people the hope that anybody can do this. When I got involved in the business, I focused on getting my friends in and the people I cared about that I wanted to get involved in this business one by one. And as I got my friends involved, I made sure that they got their friends involved and I helped present the opportunity to their friends for them. And uh, after my meeting, I'll figure out what's the next step. All right, guys, we're done with the meeting. It was a, it was a productive night. What, what's next? We'll go out maybe you know, to a nice restaurant and hang out, or we'll go to a nice club, at maybe some hotel lounge. And you know, that's the lifestyle that, that I'm living right now. I'm taking advantage. I'm at, I'm at a young age. I'm only 27 years old. And I want people my age to know that you know, we don't need to go to work every single day on the grind, nine hours a day. You know? Montevideo is an, an easy business opportunity to get to Black Diamond. You need to put in work, but it's a small sacrifice and commitment. It's going to pay off after a year or two years or three years of working this business to be financially free, to live that lifestyle you've always dreamed of. All right, guys, I'd like to thank you guys for joining me today, living the dream that I'm living every single day. Just want to let you guys know that we all have the same opportunity in this business venture together we called Montevideo. I'll see you guys at the top.